Hey guys, Jen here. Welcome back to my channel. In this video, I am doing my big end of month declutter for August and I'm really motivated. I think I'm gonna get a lot done today. space closet it doesn't need to be under here where kids can get to it and where I stub my toe on it like every time I sit at the desk to do something so it's gonna go clear spaces clear spaces so, we need so what is left is a warranty that needs to be filed printer printer paper I have got all of these wires, I'm gonna find like a nice basket for them. The guitar needs a home. Over here, I have all of my husband's school stuff and that's just like, it's got important documents that are gonna time out in like three weeks, but I just, I've had it there for like six months and I need it to stay until the documents time out. And then the drum and the chair. And in this closet went the filing cabinet and that little file box thing of notepads right there that I'm gonna try and bring back out. But it's gonna be there for a minute. A ton of stuff just went straight into the trash. Papers that timed out, coupons that we thought we would use, just like little stuff that got set there that were legitimately just trash. Um, I do have two piles of paperwork that I'm not gonna show you guys on the bar for us to go through and file in the filing cabinet. There's nothing left on that desk. I'm gonna get the rest of the stuff off. But I think I might just move the whole desk. I think that that I let it get so out of hand that just making it so that nothing is there anymore, I feel like that's not enough. I feel like now I actually need to like rearrange this room. You know, there's something about rearranging. Like it just brings everything out of the cracks and my room has been a struggle and I really don't like going to sleep and feeling overwhelmed in my space. So yeah, I think I'm just gonna do a whole big change the whole room go through everything that's in here revamp Ugh, that's gonna be so much work that's that's right i can feel that it's the right thing to do i can feel it all right let's slam through this command velcros so I'm pretty pleased with how they work on a lot of stuff oh, this space feels so good I that is motivating to me like a little space with nothing in it and I'm like Oh my gosh, I love this so much more than I loved it before. <laughs> so yes, yes, oh, there is my morale boost. So here is everything else. Obviously everything that's come away from the desk area and then some like baby stuff that'll probably get shuffled around. And then I just have a few loads of laundry and like we're washing the sheets right now. So that's like our big bedspread that goes on this. And yeah, we'll, we'll get to that, we'll get to it. But for now, this this is why I declutter right here for spaces that feel like that. stuff on top of the bed but we're gonna just try to see if we can lift it to move it I don't know if that's gonna work but we're gonna try
Okay, so drawers are kind of gone through and redone. I feel like everything on the bed actually is gonna have a super easy home to go to when I'm done. But there is stuff underneath the bed and here's the pile of just like randomness that I found when I was moving the bed. So I'm gonna quickly pull everything out from underneath the bed um, and then I'm gonna decide if and how and where I'm gonna place a desk in here. Boy, there just shouldn't be a desk in here. That's what it comes to, is bedrooms should not also be offices. Thank you, Ikea, but no thank you. It's not working. But that's everything except for, well, there's a pillow because we need to put a pillow. It's a, our, our mattress isn't the right size. It's a whole big thing. It has to stay there. Um, and then that is a base case and there is an amp behind it and then that's the screwdriver I just used but that is all the way under the bed. Ooh, I may end up moving that. I don't know. We'll see if I can find a place for it or not. So that is cute. The end tables look good. Now I'm just gonna deal with all this stuff on the bed. I know you guys have seen me declutter this silly caddy of infant stuff like three times in the last month. The thing is you have 10 months to prepare for a baby and it's like, guys, it's like too long. <laughs> you end up over preparing and you just don't need that much. So I feel like I finally got down to the right a number of items here. So I have got all of his blankets I'm gonna store upstairs because we do use them but we're not like grabbing for them every day. All of this stuff here, can't see the pile on film. This is all gonna go, just some clothes that we never really wore, things he's grown out of, socks that don't have matches. Right, to keep this little blue thing here. And we've got just his basket of little toys. He's got a few more that he's playing with in the crib right now. Um, but yeah, so we can just hand him his little toy basket and I've got two extra sheets in the bottom. They're not folded, they're just wadded up and put down there because I'm not super organized. I just, I don't keep a lot around. <laughs> Um, let me give you a better look in here. So that's where like for real, there's his socks. He's got his one church outfit and everything else we're just throwing in from the dryer. Like so pretty much his stuff gets sorted, not folded. And in the back here, I do have his nail kit kind of hidden. Um, so Once you've seen all the things, all the places, I hope it means that you'll come home to me. Once you try.